Aloha everyone, this is Dr. Beth Ann. I am an intuition guide and I'm doing a midweek energy update today. Um, all right, we have a card. <laughs> First, I'm going to share um, an angel message and then I'm going to share the card that just flew out of the deck for us. Um, and the message that the angels gave me today when I said, What is the energy right now? is I saw a picture of soil soil with seeds in it um, and lately they've been giving me a lot of pictures of roots and the ground um, and the the wisdom that came with that message was that this has been a year where a lot of people have felt uprooted they have been through a lot of change they have been through a lot of transformation and a lot of um, for some people like relocation relocation in a job and a relationship maybe you've moved somewhere maybe just relocation from your old self where you've really traveled and moved far from who you once were. It's been a, a deeply, really a year reckoning for a lot of people. Um, and the angel said, return to the soil. And where they went with that, because I was like, what's with all the dirt you're showing me lately, is they said that for many of us, we were like plants that were in our little pot, and we thought that's who we were. We were a nice, happy plant, and we were going to be in this pot and remain in this pot forever. And um, we were very safe and comfortable in the pot. And then they said, but what if you weren't really a plant? What if you were a tree? What if you were really a big oak tree and you were meant to grow these big, beautiful roots and you were meant to grow tall or maybe you're a willow tree and you were meant to be able to move with the wind um, and, and bend and not break? What if you're not a plant at all meant to be in that little pot? What if you are a giant tree who needed to be relocated <laughs> and uprooted and put down in new soil, returned to the earth so that that you could really grow roots that were going to support you in who you were meant to become in this world. Isn't that amazing? I thought that was such a deep, beautiful metaphor. And um, it moved me to just share it with whoever's watching today to offer that to you as encouragement as well right now. If your life has fallen apart this year, or you feel like it's just been destroyed or some part of you has been destroyed, well then wonderful, you're not a plant. You needed to leave that pot in order to be transitioned and transplanted and relocated into a giant field that's really meant to support your bigger growth. And what's happened for a lot of us is that that, that transplantation has not fully happened all the way yet. Um, and so it's been unsettling and it's been uncertain. And a lot of us are asking the question, are you sure I did the right thing? I thought I listened to my intuition. I thought I followed, was like following higher self and higher power and instead life got so messy but you're actually doing really beautiful it's just still in transition and those those roots that you've put down need more time to to dig in and to anchor and to really grow a little bit more so you're exactly where you're meant to be you just weren't meant to be a plant you were meant to be a giant beautiful tree whatever tree of your choosing um, and then the card that flipped Oh, actually two fell out. Oh, this is really beautiful. Um, so these two are the ones that came out. And my sense of this is that for a year, this has been what it's felt like for a lot of us this year. Um, there's been a lot of things in 2019 that have really broken some part of our heart and really um, broken us up inside. But then the card that flew out with it was this woman holding a heart. I love that it just says women holding a heart. Um, and traditionally this card, um, I'm working with the energy oracle card deck represents like that sense of unconditional love and mending, um, mending our hearts and growing bigger and going through a cracking open process where we're able to bring more love inside of ourselves. And through that love, we mend our hearts and now we're loving, we're holding more space for love and we're loving in a way that is bigger and we're loving in a way that's more authentic to the truth of who we are so it's all working together for how it needs to be and where it needs to be and um, return to the earth when you feel disoriented right now like literally go out in nature and go put your hands on the ground and return to the earth and know that you are being planted and firmer soil to really support the truth and the beauty of who you're becoming. And it's been a hard year for a lot, but it is moving in the right direction. It is definitely moving us towards this.
Yay. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much for joining me in this space today. I will be back with more intuitive wisdom in these videos, and I hope you have an amazing rest of the day. Aloha and light.